So hello everybody and welcome to 25 days of Dax Fridays challenge. If you don't know what that is, just go down below, check all the details and participate. It's definitely not too late. If you want to know what the answer of day 23 is or you want to know how I did it, this is the video for you. Let's get started. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, day 23, which employee had the highest sales in 2021? Now, warning, if you are doing this after the new year, it will say 2022 because I made Northwind a living uh, company, okay? So make sure that you get the file, you go to curva.com and you check the result there as you specify down there, right? So the result that you get here might not be the one that you get next year. Just so you know. Okay, so we're going to do it as we always do, first without DAX, then with DAX. So... First, without DAX, employees with the highest sales in 2021. Employees, so we need our employees. I have created a um, column called full name. This does not exist in the original Northwind. Make sure you get mine and refresh so you get the latest. So, this is the full name. Highest sales. It is given a call for total sales. And it says in 2021, so we're going to pick the year. And the year is 2021. Apply. We sort it. And Nancy is the employee with the highest sales with 132,000.8. Okay, so that's the value that we need to get in our DAX to make sure that we got it right. So, how do we do it with DAX? Let's do it. We have our solutions table here. New measure, day 23. My God, there's so little left. Okay, so the first thing that we need to do is to calculate the sales for 2021, right? So I'm gonna set a variable for the current year. Current year. And this is going to be a year of today. So whatever is on your computer today's date, get the year. For me, this year is 2021. If you do it next year, it will be 2022. Remember that. So return. And then we're going to calculate the sales. Total sales of where the year, calendar year, where are you, my dear? Calendar year is equal to our variable, current year. You might ask, Okay, why don't you do equal 2021? Well, I want this to be a living company again. So next year, current year will be 2022. So this is calculated dynamically, that's all. So this thing will give us the sales for 2021. Now we wanna have top sales. Now, every time that we've done top sales something or the highest or We've used the same pattern. If you've been following 25 days of DAX Fridays, you know the pattern by heart now. So we're going to apply it here again. So we're going to do the top N, the highest, the highest of employees. That's our table. And then what is the measure that we want to do on the employees table is the one that you see below, right? And then descending. So what is it telling us there? It says it returns multiple columns. Top end is a table function. It returns a table. This thing expects to return a number. So it's telling you, hey, I'm expecting a number, you're giving me a table, what's going on here? So to see the results of these, you need to put it in a table, table tools, new table, and put it in there, I'll show you the table. Well, obviously we would need to have the, the current year here, which is 2021, well, it was not our variable, and this is the person with the higher sales. This is what the calculation that we were doing, it was returning these, when it was suspecting one value. So how do we get the value that we want? I need to put this in a card. You've heard this a thousand times in order to be able to deliver it to you. So we know how to return a card, right? We're going to do, we go here, 
we do a calculate selected selected value of full name. I want to have the full name. So we put day 23 in there. There is a card and hopefully, hopefully, Nancy shows up. Hi, Nancy. Okay, so we got it right. Remember, you might get a different solution depending on when you're actually you're running the challenge. So make sure you go to curval.com to the 25 days of challenge and check what the actual value is because that refreshes every day. Okay, um, this is all. This is all. How are you doing? We have two days left and then it's Christmas and you, you get rid of me completely for a while. <laughs> okay, so let's do this. I will see you tomorrow again.